Hi everyone, this is Nila and welcome to another tutorial of Trillium Marketing. Today we are going to design this uh, Google new logo. This is not uh, new, but uh, this is uh, the standard one that the Google is using right now. They're, I think the last year it's been, uh, you know, released. So I'm going to design it. So this is very simple and easy way that I'm using to design this logo. What I'm going to do, I'm just creating a simple square here and uh, stroke the color is off and it uh, stroke is uh, black. This is only for the reference purpose and what I'm going to do now I'm just creating a simple ellipse here like this uh, just dragging a simple ellipse and uh, and now what I'm going to do I am selecting it and paste in same place and transform this and divide by div uh, clicking on it and here you can divide it at 1.618 so you will get the golden uh, 1.618 is the golden ratio average so with the another circle that we have created is the golden circle of the bigger one uh, of the first one so we are going to take this one and now what we are going to do we are uh, simply creating some lines that will be the marking lines for this logo design for example like this and uh, here i'm creating another line that is uh, here so I will create line on uh, every corner not the corner in the middle as well oh sorry for this you can just press shift when you drag your lines and now we need to create another line and that is here and now so it will be looking like this now here I'm selecting each and everything together, align it and keep it in the middle uh, here. So it will be looking like this. Now uh, place it in the middle section of your artboard. And now what we are going to do, we are taking this uh, rectangular tool again. And now we are simply taking this line as a standard line and uh, now make sure when you are doing this your smart guides are checked and snap to point is also checked so make sure all these things uh, are done when you are doing this so now we are going to place it in the middle and just uh, to keep everything aligned and on place i am just uh, aligned vertically center and uh, now what uh, for the reference i am just increasing the span of this line and now we have to work on this area that will be you can see the tipping of uh, this g has been creating a line just like this and this and so i need to make a simple lines like this make sure when you do these things so First of all, let me do it. So make sure when you do, then the point of inter intersection will come up from the, the median line. So you can see it forms a simple triangle here and point of intersection is this line. So now what we are going to do, we are selecting each and everything together like this. And here I want to create, click on it, this shape builder tool here. And I want to drag a simple shape uh, here like this and here. Like this so you can see this is the place for G and now we are creating another shape and here and here so these are the shapes that we needed and now rest of the shapes we have deleted so I will delete this area like this and clean it each and everything that we have done and then we will add the color uh, to this G and uh, now I think everything is cleaned just remove this one from here and okay let me add the colors first first of all I want to take this one and here I'm using this eye dropper tool and I will pick this color from here that is red and in the same way I want to pick another one that is the yellow and uh, here I want to get this one that is green and in the same way I want to take this blue from here so you can see how easy 
is this to design this logo just by maintaining a few formatting lines then it's ready so you can see there this is very simple and easy way to design this logo this is 100 percent vector and we easily created it so uh, thank you so much for watching i will come back to another tutorial subscribe to my, my channel and have a very good day bye bye